Peter Asar's Odin Wingy is a footballer who plays as a forward for Premier League club Stoke City. Odin Wingy grew up in Russia and Nigeria and began his career with Bendel Insurance in the Nigeria Premier League. He then earned a move to European football with Belgian side La Louvierie where he spent three seasons before moving to French side Lille. Odin Wingy scored 26 goals for Lille which prompted Lokomotiv Moscow to pay a fee of £8 10 million pounds for his services in July 2007. He scored 23 times in three and a half years for Lokomotiv before leaving for English side West Bromwich Albion in August 2010. He scored 30 Premier League goals for the Baggies which won him three Premier League Player of the Month awards. A failed move to Queen's Park Rangers saw him fall out of favour with Steve Clark, and he was sold to Cardiff City in August 2013 for a fee of a £2.25 million. He spent six months at Cardiff before joining Stoke City in a player exchange with Kenan Jones in January 2014. Odin Wingy made his debut for the Nigerian national football team in 2002 and has represented the country over 60 times, including at two World Cups and four Africa Cup of Nations as well as winning silver at the 2008 Olympics. Club career, early career, Odin Wingy was born in Tashkent, Uzbek SSR, Soviet Union to a Nigerian father and a Russian mother, both of whom were medical students. He moved with his family to Nigeria when he was two years old before returning to Russia to complete his secondary education. Whilst living in Russia he played in the youth teams at KAMAZ and CSKA Moscow. At the age of 17 he moved back to Nigeria and after spending a short time with amateurs AS Rasines Lagos he became a professional with Nigeria Premier League side Bendel Insurance, where he scored 19 goals in 53 league appearances from 2000 to 2002. La Luvia Re, Odin Wingy had an unsuccessful trial with Anderlecht before he signed for La Luvia Re in 2002 and made his mark by helping the club to win the Belgian Cup in his first season. This earned La Luvia requalification into the UEFA Cup where they played Portuguese side Benfica, Odin Wingy scoring in a 1-1 one one draw. He had a trial with Blackburn Rovers in August 2004. Lille, scoring nine goals in 44 appearances attracted the attention of the French Ligue 1 side Lille OSC and before long he was a starter in the first team playing in the French Ligue 1. Famous for his technique and pace. The Nigerian player was being monitored by a number of prestigious European clubs. Odin Wingy indicated that he wanted to stay at Lille and help them fight for the league the following season and scored five league goals for them in the 2006 Euro 07 season as well as two against AC Milan at the San Siro to take Lille to the UEFA Champions League knockout stages. Lokomotiv Moscow, on July 16, 2007, he signed for Lokomotiv Moscow for a reported fee of 14 US dollars a million on a four-year contract. In three seasons for Lokomotiv, Odin Winnie became the driving force of the attack and one of their most important players. During his time at Lokomotiv Stadium, Odin Winnie managed 21 goals in the Russian Premier League from 75 games. West Bromwich Albion, 2010 Euro 11 on August 20, 2010 Odin Wingy signed for English Premier League club West Bromwich Albion for an undisclosed fee on a two-year contract, with the option of a third year in the club's favour. A day later, he scored the 81st minute winning goal on his Premier League debut, a 1-0-0 win against Sunderland. Shortly after signing for West Bromwich Albion, photographs showed locomotive Moscow fans celebrating the sale of Odin Winnie through the use of racist banners targeted at the player. One banner included the image of a banana and read thanks West Brom. Before West Brom's game against Tottenham Hotspur in September 2010, it was announced that West Brom fans would unfurl a banner to counter the racist one. The banner read thanks locomotive and is accompanied by a picture of Odin Winnie celebrating his winner on his debut against Sunderland. Odin Winnie scored again for West Brom as they defeated Arsenal 3 a Euro 2 at the Emirates Stadium on September 25, 2010. Odin Winnie scored a brace for West Brom on December 5, 2010, as they defeated fellow promoted side Newcastle United 3 a Euro 1 at the Hawthorns. Odin Winnie scored the second goal for West Brom which brought his season tally in the Premier League to 10 goals, only two behind Robert Earnshaw's Premier League record for the club. 
April 9 saw West Brom travel to the Stadium of Light to play Sunderland. Odom Winry continued to impress and scored a goal in the 29th minute to level the scores. His side eventually won 3 a Euro 2, 3 points significantly helping his side's survival hopes. After the game, he announced his desire to keep on playing well for West Brom by aiming to score 15 league goals. On April 16 Odom Winnie edged closer to this personal target when he became West Brom's joint top goal scorer ever in a single season in the Premier League with a goal against Chelsea, bringing his tally to 12. Because of his continued success in his debut season in England, Odom Winnie was reportedly targeted by a number of big clubs, including Italian giants Juventus, but Odom Winnie dispelled talk of a move, stating that he's happy at West Brom. Odom Winry continued his fine form, scoring a lovely curling effort with his left foot in the fifth minute against Tottenham Hotspur. This brought him on to 13 league goals for the season, and meant that he had scored four in his last five games. On April 30, Odom Winry became the first player in West Brom's Premier League history to score in four consecutive games. This goal came against Aston Villa and meant he had scored 15 goals thus far in his debut season. It would also contribute to Odom Winnie's second Premier League Player of the Month award of the season. Odom Winnie is only the sixth man to have received the accolade twice in a season in the awards history. His side faced Everton at the Hawthorns on May 14 and Odom Winnie provided an assist for Yusuf Mulambu to score the only goal of the game. The result put West Brom on 46 points, bolstering their chances of finishing as the Midlands' highest placed club in the Premier League. Odom when he ended the 2010 Euro 11 season as West Bromwich Albion's top goal scorer with 15 league goals. 2011 a Euro 12. On August 18, it was announced that Odom when had signed a new three-year agreement with West Bromwich Albion after a four million pounds bid from Wigan Athletic was turned down by the club. After some injury setbacks, he scored his first goal of the 2011 a Euro 12 season away to Norwich City pouncing on a confusion between Richie DeLate and Declan Rudd. Odom Winnie's second goal of the season came in the Black Country derby, where West Bromwich Albion defeated Wolverhampton Wanderers to a Euro Zero. Odom Winnie scored a spectacular goal against Blackburn Rovers on December 17, putting West Brom into a late lead after James Morrison had scored a stunning volley earlier in the half. The result put West Brom up to 13th in the table heading into the busy Christmas period and gave Odom Winnie his third league goal of the season. Odom Winnie opened the scoring in the 20th minute of the Baggies' next fixture at Newcastle United, a 3 Euro 2 victory, on Tuesday 21 December. The result extended Newcastle's winless run in the Premier League to six games, put West Brom up to 10 and sealed their first victory at Newcastle in the league since 1977. On February 12, Odom Winnie scored his first hat trick for the club in a 5 Euro 1 victory over black country rival Wolverhampton Wanderers. Odom Winnie followed this up on February 25 with another fine performance, scoring two goals in a 4 Euro 0 thumping of Sunderland. His performances in the month of February led him to be named the Premier League Player of the Month for the third time in his career. 2012 Euro 13. Odom when we started off the new Premier League season well, converting a penalty in a 3 Euro 0 victory over Liverpool on August 18, 2012. During West Brom's game on September 15 against Fulham, Odom Winnie kicked out at Sasha Ryetha and was penalised with a red card. West Brom went on to lose the game 3 Euro 0, their first defeat of the season. On November 5, 2012, Odom Winnie scored a brace against Southampton his second of the season coming from a shot that deflected off my Yoshida past Paulo Gazaniga and his third a headed goal from a Shane Long cross. Odom Winnie headed in the winner against Chelsea on November 17, pushing West Brom to a 2 Euro 1 home victory, their sixth win from seven home games to start the season. Later in the season Odom Winnie scored against Aston Villa to make it 2 Euro 2 in the 83rd minute after West Brom had been two goals down at half-time in an enthralling match. On January 25, 2013, West Brom announced they had rejected a formal transfer request from Odom Winnie. Odom Winnie's future at West Bromwich Albion came under doubt when he launched a tirade against his club on Twitter, 
in addition to accusing them of reaching into his pocket, reiterating his wish for a move elsewhere. On January 31, 2013, he was reportedly seen outside Loftus Road in an attempt to sign for Queen's Park Rangers, but was refused entry as no offer was accepted for him. He was widely criticized for his attempt to join QPR with Albion chairman branding him wholly unprofessionally. After initially being sent home from training on his return to West Brom, Odom Wingy was later disciplined by the club for his actions on transfer deadline day and resumed training, while also publicly apologizing for his behavior. He returned to the side Sunderland on February 23, 2013 coming on as a substitute in the final few minutes and was jeered by some Albion supporters. Steve Clark continued to use Odom Wingy as a substitute which caused him to again attack the club on Twitter. At the end of the season Steve Clark stated that he expects Odom Wingy to leave West Brom in August 2013. Cardiff City On September 2, 2013 Odom Wingy signed a two-year contract with Cardiff City for a £2.25 million. Speaking after the move Odom Wingy stated that he was eager for a fresh start in his career. He made his debut on September 22, 2013 in a 1-0 0 defeat against Tottenham Hotspur. He scored his first goal for the club two days later in a 3-0 2 defeat against West Ham United in the League Cup. He also scored in a 2 Euro 1 loss against Newcastle United on October 5, 2013. He developed a good relationship with manager Mulkey Mackay who stated that Odem and Jai is a joy to work with. However Mackay was replaced with Ole Gunnar Solskjaer in January 2014 and Odem Wingy fell out of favour. Stoke City On January 28, 2014 Odem Wingy joined Stoke City on an 18-month contract in a player exchange with Kenan Jones. Odom Winnie described his move to Stoke as a step forward. He made his debut the next day in a 1-0-0 defeat away at Sunderland. He scored his first goal for Stoke on February 8, 2014 in a 2-0-2 2 draw against Southampton. Odom Winnie scored in a 3-0-1 win over West Ham United on March 15, 2014. He followed this up with goals against Aston Villa and Hull City. He ended 2013 a Euro 14 with five goals in 15 appearances for the Potters which earned him a place in Nigeria's 30-man provisional squad for the 2014 FIFA World Cup. International career, Odom Winnie chose to represent Nigeria where his father was born. His first match came as a substitute in a 3 Euro 0 victory over Kenya on May 4, 2002. In the finals, he scored in the 80th and 82nd minute against South Africa. At the 2006 Africa Cup of Nations, he played in the semi-final as the Super Eagles lost to Kati Eid for 1-0-0. He was also included to play for Nigeria in the 2008 Africa Cup of Nations. In 2008, Odom Wingy was selected as an overage player for the Super Eagles Olympic squad scoring in the quarter-final against Kati Edva as the team earned the silver medal after losing the final to defending champions Argentina. He captained the team for the 2010 Africa Cup of Nations, and when Nigeria bowed out of the competition at the semi-final stage, Odom Winri controversially openly criticized coach Shaibu Amodu's tactics, blaming them for the defeat. He was chosen as part of the best 11 of the tournament. Odom Wingy was selected for the Nigeria squad for the 2010 FIFA World Cup, appearing against Argentina and Greece in the Super Eagles group stage exit. After the team's elimination, Odom Wingy, who was omitted from the team for the final match against South Korea, publicly criticized coach Lars Lager for current CK. Odom Wingy was involved in a dispute with Nigeria's coach Stephen Keshi after being omitted from the squad for 2013 Africa Cup of Nations but was named in Nigeria's 30-man provisional squad for the 2014 FIFA World Cup on May 12, 2014, despite not representing the team for over a year. In June 2014, he made the cut for the final 23-man squad. After appearing as a substitute in the team's opening match against Iran he was named in the starting lineup for the second group fixture against Bosnia and Herzegovina on June 21. In scoring the only goal of the match, Odom Winnie gave the Super Eagles their first win at the FIFA World Cup since the 1998 edition. Personal life, 
Odinwimi was born to a Nigerian father and a Russian Tatar mother. His middle name, Osars, means God chooses. Odinwimi married his fianca copyrightee, Sarah Fallon, on May 26, 2012 at a church in Northampton after two years of dating. Career Statistics, Club, as of match played May 11, 2014, International, as of match played June 30, 2014, Honours, International, Nigeria, Olympic Silver Medal, 2008, Africa Cup of Nations, 3rd place, 2004, 2006, 2010, Individual, Premier League Player of the Month, September 2010, April 2011, February 2012. English Premier League African Player of the Year, 2011, References. External links, Peter Odom Winry Career Stats at Soxabase.